my name is Chrislyn Smith and my topic for the HI-410 course project is three-dimensional printing. Three-dimensional printing is, an, is additive manufacturing. It's all about adding volume, depth, and statement to a two-dimensional object. Three-dimensional printing is a great investment for every innovative and creative thinking being. The purpose of 3D printing is for an artist to be able to touch an object that they've created on paper or on the computer, or an object that they never would have thought that would be possible to touch. Or for the medical field, creating tools to help better mankind. Dimensional printing is an additive is additive manufacturing. It's all about adding volume, depth, and statement to a two-dimensional object. Three-dimensional printing is a great investment for every innovative and creative thinking being. The purpose of 3D printing is for an artist to be able to touch an object they've created on paper or on the computer, or an object that they would have never thought that they created. Or for the three-dimensional objects are created by telling by a device telling the printer what to create and then the printer starts adding layer upon layer of material into the shape of the two-dimensional object to bring it to life. The material used to create the objects are usually sandstone, metal, alloy, plastic, rubber, and many more are starting to be used daily. 3D printing technology or additive manu manufacturing became prevalent in the 1980s when Charles Hull created a process known as lithography, which uses UV lasers to cure photopolymers in 1984, which allowed for creating phototypes. In 1999, 3D printing was introduced to the field of medicine in Texas at Wilfred Hall Medical Center. A few surgeons took on the task of separating a set of conjoined twins. Currently, the use of 3D printing is growing daily. More and more lives are being made easier by it. 3D printing is being used to create things from bioprinting tissues and organs to drug delivery devices. 3D printing is being used to produce different tissues and organs through a process called bioprinting. Customizable prosthesis and implants are being created at a quick rate and are cost effective. Models are very helpful for, for physicians to study and simulate surgery on a clinic. Cadavers are also being made and used in surgical training. For the medical field, the sky is the limit with the use of three-dimensional printing. So many things can be created to aid the medical field and in many other instances. Who knows what the future may hold for three-dimensional printing. It is only going to advance as time goes by and more and more people will start needing it for different things.